The riders all lined up on the start. A lot of anticipation surrounding the Women's Tour. First visit to Wales, heading out of Dolgethly. And uh, the conditions for them, 15 to 17 degrees Celsius today. Cloudy with a chance of some showers. The wind direction should give them a tailwind up most of the route today. And then heading in towards Colwyn Bay and a little crosswind. In Atrocious conditions, the breakaway group of Emily Moberg, Suzanne Anderson, Marta Taliaferro and Natalie Gunter contested the first iceberg sprint of the day at Tal Sarnai Hut, 33.2 kilometres covered. Anderson was the rider with the most to gain as the highest rider on GC, but would be the one to miss out with points and seconds going to Moberg from Taliaferro and Grincher. The next target of the day would be the Category 1 Bolsha Mine climb for the Queen of the Mountains. The catch is almost made up to the breakaway group and uh, Team Sunweb here setting the pace so high and they're now uh, after that early attack on the climb as the catch is made by Cassia Nuvadova. They just want to try and prevent anyone else trying to go clear. It's going to be Lucinda Brand of Team Sunweb that leads over the summit of the Volta Mine for the Queen of the Mountains competition. Good second place there by Natalie Grincher, but importantly, Corin Rivera looking absolutely supreme here in that over energy. Green leader's jersey all to play for as we head to the second climb. Having attacked between the two climbs of the day, Marta Bastianelli, the former World Road Race champion, now looks towards the summit of the Category 1. Nanguanant climbs 6.9 kilometres in length, average gradient of 4.4%. She takes the maximum points in the Skoda Queen of the Mountains a competition. Our two chasers, Georgia Williams and Hannah Barnes, take second and third, with jersey wearer Elisa Longaborghini crossing the summit in fourth. Ellen Van Dyke would lead a group of somewhere riders with her teammate Flaughty Mackay, Leah Kirschman and race leader Corin Rivera just ahead of Cicely Utrub Ludwig and Lucinda Brand taking the one point. For the Queen of the Mountains, a leader, Lisa Longaborghini, all she has to do now is get to the finish to take that Queen of the Mountains title. After the climb of the Cat 1 Nant Gwinnant, Marta Bastianelli was reeled back in. It was proving to be a ferocious day of racing. The main contenders who were hunting for every second and looking for any sign of weakness from race leader Corin Rivera. As they hit the final iceberg sprint point with 26 and a half kilometers to go, the American in a show of strength took another three second bonus with nearest rival Mariana Voss crossing the line second with Christine Majerus in third. Rivera was looking ever more the champion in waiting as they headed into the closing stages and the finish in Colwyn Bay. A lot of teams in contention at the moment trying to get their sprinter up to the front. 300 metres to go and it's Elisa Longaborghini that hits the front with Kirsten Veld right on the wheel. Majerus is there but look at that pink jersey. Mariana Voss, Raxan Fournier is there but here comes Lotta Lepisto. Georgia Bronzini is up there. Lotta Lepisto has got the front. Lepisto takes it. Cervelo Bigler get the stage of victory and Georgia Bronzini has to settle for second place and we saw a little fist pump from Cora Rivera. That was an amazing sprint by Lotta Lapista. She just hit herself perfectly that whole lead out. She didn't have many teammates on the front working for her. She was tucked in nicely behind Marianne Voss, who, like we said, has been so consistent this week. And then she just popped out before the finish, and that's Georgia Bronzini taking second place there. Lotta Lapisto edges out Georgia Bronzini for the win in Colwyn Bay. Marina Voss is third and Marta Bastianelli fourth. Coral Rivera in the green jersey came in eighth to seal the overall victory. A great win for Lotta Lapisto on the final stage of the 2018 Over Energy Women's Tour. Third place for Marina Voss helped to secure the Breast Cancer Points classification. The Iceberg Sprints jersey goes to Team Sunweb's Coral Rivera. Elisa Longaborghini of Wiggle High Five is the Skoda Queen of the Mountains. The Adnams best British rider is Danny Rowe. And Team Sunweb's Con Rivera is the winner of the 2018 OVO Energy Women's Tour. Rivera's advantage over Mariana Voss was 11 seconds in the end. A great performance from Danny Rowe to claim third place, just ahead of Christine Majerus, Amy Peters and Elisa Longo-Borghini.